Hey everyone, this is Johnny with JCS Guns. Uh, we're pretty excited to have the opportunity to test this Eagle Eye ammunition. There's a lot of people that have been doing a lot of tests and reviews on it, and we have the opportunity to test it. Uh, this is a great, match grade ammunition, a factory loaded ammunition, and um, they guarantee half MOA per lot or they won't ship it out. And if it doesn't meet the standards, what they do is they discard it. So um, right now they're currently only doing a 308 and a 223. The 308 is a 175 grain bolt tail hollow point. And uh, what we did here, we know we took a bullet apart and we weighed it, and he weighed to 177 grains. I spoke over Justin over at Eagle Eye, and they said uh, they gave me a couple of different information on their ammunition. One is they shorten up the bolt tail. And if you go to their website, they have a picture of theirs and the Sierra, and you can see that it is quite a bit shorter on the bolt tail. Now this is a jacketed core, and uh, the, what they did is they moved the, the weight, the mass of the weight down to the center of the, of the projectile, and that's gonna, supposed to help out for flight. Another thing is that they take a lot of pride in the quality of material that they use on the brass, the primer pocket, the thickness of the brass is consistent all the way around and they take 28 different steps to make this uh, brass, this casing here. Everything is done in-house there at Eagle Eye Ammunition. And uh, so what we're going to do right now is going to go ahead and take the opportunity to do some testing at 100 yards. We're going to use two different weapons. We're going to use a full custom build and this is an 11 and a quarter to one Krieger barrel. And then we're going to use a stock factory 308 tactical and this is a 1 in 10 twist. The only thing that's been done to this is the McMillan stock and the Night Force scope. It has not been accurized stock trigger pull and everything. So this way we can get two different results from two different rifles. So let me get set up and let me go ahead and uh, do some test groups and then we'll go down range and we'll review the ammo. Okay, what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and sight in the rifles to the Eagle Eye. And uh, we're going to go ahead and start doing some testing at 100 yards. What we're going to do is we're going to do two three-round groups and one five-round group per rifle. And then we'll go down range and we'll go ahead and check out the difference on the testing and the group size. Right, guys we just shot some test groups here at 100 yards uh, once again I want to remind you that we shot with two different rifles one was a stock fam factory Remington 700 308 tactical and the only thing we've done to that rifle was just add a stock to it no there hasn't been no bedding no accuracy package no trigger job the trigger is very very hard the trigger weights real heavy so and the other one is a full custom Remington 700 using a 11 and a quarter to one twist Krieger barrel. I want to go ahead and show you a little close-up on the on the test groups. Uh, the first three, three on top is using the stock factory Remington 700. This is uh, my first three rounds. This is my second three rounds. I got a little bit more comfortable with the rifle and this is a five round group uh, which you can see that uh, I just did real really bad on that one and uh, a lot has to do with the trigger weight of the rifle itself and then uh, we ended up shooting uh, the custom rifle and this was my first three rounds two right here one's there and then my second three round group which was a little bit better and that's halfway MOA or under and then I think uh, this is probably uh, a very good five round group you can see it's real tight for being five rounds it's right around half MOA and then um, we had Lada shoot the factory rifle three rounds here and you can see that her groups opened up also and that's a lot to do with also again the trigger and then she shot 
the custom rifle using a, the three rounds and you can see here uh, the groups. Okay, so overall, um, I'm very happy with the ammunition. Um, it, it did perform the way it, they said it was gonna perform. Uh, we still have a little bit more ammo left. We're gonna go ahead and do a little bit more testing off film. Um, a lot of people say that uh, it's cheaper or less expensive to reload, and it's not less expensive. What you do when you reload is get consistency and accuracy. So that's what these people are trying to do with their ammunition, where you can go buy it straight out of the factory don't have to worry about reloading and you can get consistency and accuracy out of a factory grade ammunition um also I was talking to justin that maybe sometime in the near future they might consider doing some different hunting ammo different ammunition uh, calibers so they're probably going to do your common factory or your common hunting loads which would be your 308s 223s uh, 243 30 out 6s and uh, they're gonna probably have a hunting leaded bullet on it versus a bolt tail hollow point. Um, they have a real nice Instagram, they have a Facebook and um, a website. We'll go ahead and put those links down below. And if you guys have any questions, go ahead and email us. Uh, follow us on Instagram, like our videos, subscribe to our videos. And if you get a chance, just go ahead and leave us a comment, see what you guys think about our videos and the, the comment on the ammunition, see what you guys think. Once again, this is Johnny with JCS Guns, and we appreciate you guys.